Ja, hallo und herzlich willkommen, meine Freunde. Ich heiße euch herzlich willkommen ja, zu diesem Video von Escape from Tarkov. Und zwar sind das die Gameplay-Ausschnitte, die ich aus dem Stream, aus dem Alpha-Stream vom Mittwoch, dem 18.05. ja, sozusagen mitgeschnitten bzw. mir einfach auf YouTube runtergeladen und für euch das Wichtigste nochmal zusammengeschnitten habe bzw. alles an Gameplay-Material, sodass ihr da auch mal für die, die es verpasst haben, ein zusammenhängendes Material habt, damit ihr seht, was genau kam im Stream vor. Das Einzige, was ich ausgelassen habe, ist so der Frage-Antworten-Part, den die gemacht haben in den Pausen sozusagen, wo nur Screenshots liefen. Das habe ich einfach mal rausgeschnitten, weil das doch alles ziemlich in die Länge gezogen hat und ja, kommen wir einmal zu dem ingame material Ihr seht jetzt gerade selbst schon, wir sehen was zum, oder haben gerade was zum Hauptmenü gesehen. Jetzt gerade im Endeffekt zum Spawn-Areal. Bevor wir da jetzt eintauchen direkt, einmal eine Frage vorweg, die sich jeder stellen wird. Und zwar, wann kommt die Alpha? Wann startet die so, dass wir die auch spielen können? Beziehungsweise diejenigen, die das Glück haben, auserwählt zu sein. Oder die, die halt die Edge of Darkness Version ähm, vorbestellt gekauft haben, wie gesagt. Ein Datum wurde leider nicht genannt, also von den Developern habe ich jetzt äh, ja, nichts gehört in dem Stream und es wurden auch unzählige Fragen dazu gestellt und ich bin der Meinung, dass eigentlich keine großartige Antwort kam. Ich habe den äh, Chat allerdings verfolgt und im Chat hat jemand, ich habe leider nicht so schnell sehen können, ob es ein Developer war oder was auch immer, wurde geschrieben, dass nächste Woche, also eine Woche nach dem Stream wohl gesagt werden soll, wann die Alpha startet. Da bin ich auf jeden Fall gespannt und hoffe, dass das stimmt, dass wirklich nächste Woche im Endeffekt mal ein Termin zumindest wieder festgesetzt wird, wann die Alpha für uns zugänglich gemacht wird. Sobald diesbezüglich natürlich wieder Neuigkeiten auftauchen sollten, werde ich euch das so schnell wie möglich mitteilen, ja, sobald ich natürlich dann diese Information auch bekommen habe. Im Stream selbst sind natürlich die Entwickler viel auf das Gameplay, auf die Mechaniken, auf die Unity 5 Engine etc. pp. eingegangen. Sie sind im Endeffekt durch verschiedene Areale gelaufen, die wir komplett sehen konnten dementsprechend und haben sich auch wieder Fights geliefert, die echt abnormal geil aussahen. Und ähm, natürlich auch viel über das Loot-System haben am Ende auch noch ein bisschen was zum Skillsystem noch mal gesagt bzw. das vorgestellt und ich sage euch liebe Freunde es sieht einfach geil aus ich möchte eigentlich auch gar nicht so viel ähm, quatschen weil es wurde nicht allzu viel Neues verraten das Beste an dem ganzen Game und den größten Eindruck kriegt ihr wenn ihr euch einfach das Gameplay Material selber anschaut was dort alles gezeigt wurde was fertiggestellt ist und was wir begutachten können es gab in dem Stream wirklich so viel zu sehen Granateneinsatz äh, Loot, wie ich schon gesagt hatte, was zum Skillsystem, was passiert, wenn man verwundet wird, einzelne Details zu den Verwundungen, wie die Verwundungen behandelt werden, Magazine, Attachments, alles, was wir im Endeffekt natürlich auch schon von den Screenshots und von anderen Gameplays kennen, aber jetzt wirklich im Verbund, im flüssigen Gameplay-Material, so als wenn wir das Spiel selber spielen. Und das, meine Freunde, gibt wirklich einen richtig geilen Eindruck. Und das, was ich gesehen habe, fetzt auf jeden Fall. Ich möchte unbedingt die Alpha sehen. Das, was ich von der Alpha gesehen habe, finde ich, ist schon sehr, sehr vielversprechend. Und ich hoffe, dass sich das am Ende alles auch so widerspiegelt in-game, wie wir das jetzt gerade im Alpha-Material sehen. Natürlich habe ich euch den Stream original vertont gelassen, sodass ihr die Informationen, die die äh, Developer euch im Endeffekt geben bzw. im Stream gegeben haben, ihr auch nochmal hören könnt, um euch da selbst ein Bild von zu machen. Deswegen, meine Freunde, habe ich das für euch zusammengeschnitten, nur das Gameplay-Material. Wenn auf jeden Fall Fragen sein sollten, wo ihr was nicht erklären könnt oder wo ihr nochmal nachfragen müsst, einfach ab in die Kommentare. Ich versuche euch da weiterzuhelfen. Und natürlich würde ich mich auch freuen, wenn ihr mir ein Feedback drin lasst, was ihr von dem Stream bzw. von dem Ingame-Material haltet, was ihr jetzt von diesem Alpha-Stream gesehen habt. Ja, ansonsten, meine Freunde, möchte ich gar nicht viel weiter quatschen. Ich wünsche euch viel Spaß mit dem Gameplay. Und lasst mir einen Daumen nach oben da, wenn es euch gefallen hat. Und ansonsten konstruktive Kritik wie immer in die Kommentare. Und ansonsten, meine Freunde, wünsche ich euch wieder was. Euer Gunshot. It's, uh, it's like uh, really hard times and it's like alternative reality in a fictional city of Russia. And we are trying to take part in this uh, situations uh, from simple survival to exploration and uh, you know mystery solving stuff like plot twists and so on uh, so we have uh, 
early morning, as I believe it's it's early morning on our on our location. We have uh, uh, right now we have fully synchronized time on the server, so everybody can uh, see exact uh, exact uh, time of day on on. You know, it's a quite you know. Uh, on every computer, on every player, will see the exact time of the day, and uh, we were also playing with with our guys from backup team. It's uh, it's whole bunch of scavengers. It's like third, third. Hey, uh, hey. Oh, it's like George, George, Bears. George yeah, got, uh, found uh, Cuba. George with shotgun. I think you, you, it's better to go. You know. Find some action. So, uh, <clears throat> my vocabulary is uh, became become becoming more less and less. So I'm just gonna switch to some you know uh, simple explanations. Maybe even switch to Russian just to ensure every, everything is going well. Okay, it's nothing. Пните Антона, спросите, там нормально все вообще идет на этот раз? Okay. <coughs> The stream uh, will consist of uh, several parts, like exact gameplay, live gameplay. Also, we uh, will uh, answer some questions. After after that, we will play more, and also show some features, some cool features like um, weapon customization and ballistics and stuff. So right now, our guys is trying to loot some stuff and provisions. Uh, just to ensure their survival. We uh, on this uh, exact location we have a uh, have a purpose. We have a goal to get out alive from this exact location and uh, transfer to factory location. And uh, this open world uh, location called Raid have uh, it uh, has uh, lots of exits, lots of secret uh, places, locked doors, and stuff. Uh, just to uh, make the game more, you know, explorable and uh, and interesting in terms of uh, finding some cool stuff and uh, reaching some unreachable places and finding some cool stuff there. So, George, can you tell us what's going on right now? There is a bridge to the uh, some. Some place where living savages, and we're going to maybe kill some guys and uh, loot them and try to get out from the location. Okay. So, so our 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 uh, savage our scout scavenger team. It's not quite a team. It's like everything on their own, and uh, they have uh, some weapons, you know, some, maybe some automatic weapons, some shotguns, even the grenades, just to, you know, to make our stream more, more funny or more, more immersive. And uh, I think we will we will be will able to see some action really soon. Kiba, how is going? Kibo, how is it going? Can you tell us, please? Uh, Enemy contact! I found the rifle. Kibo, Kibo found the man for rifle and uh, jo George said that uh, he encountered some enemies, so it's better to take haste and help him. On the road! He's quite busy, you know. He... <laughs> He wanna just mod, mod his rifle. We have a customization option somewhere. Just he installed the silencer to 
to be like special forces. Dev group team. Near the containers. On the crossroad. На перекрестке, друг. Ага, вижу, вижу, вижу. Джордж, you can tell, uh, tell uh, Kiba some recommendations and some status reports on Russian just to ensure he understand you. По-русски можешь говорить? Есть, есть, есть. Снял его. Кива плейс. Another one. Kiba Там play... еще один мышца. Kiba plays as Yusek and uh, he has... Uh... He has some used extended gear like P320, 226, 226. It's like standard firearm, standard uh, for U600 pistol and the flashlight. He found uh, uh, M4 rifle and attached a suppressor to it. Kiba said, Kiba said that uh, he, he, uh, he had a, not, not, not so many ammunition. Ты слышал его, короче, что он сказал, да? Да. А, окей. А, ну да. остались, нет? Видел одного, он убежал к общагам. Looks like uh, our battle situation is changing and uh, they got some guys, uh, they, they dropped them and some of, some of them are going to the oh, citizen block. Как общага по-английски, честно говоря, я не знаю. Dor dormitory. It's like a three uh, three floor building where uh, factory factory workers lived uh, before the Tarkov conflict. It's like it's right now. It's quite a base for uh, scavengers. They have some cool loot over there, and also some uh, interesting doors. Kiba, where are you? Which are closed, uh, and the keys from the exit of this location. Kiba is going to loot someone. As you can see, we have a very minimalistic design of battle screen. Uh, we, you know, you, you simply can't see anything that blocks your visions, like some bars and uh, fields and some crosshairs, it's like pure hardcore uh, interface. It's simply nothing. It, it and it's uh, based on the um, on the impact of uh, of the action that you take. It's like you. Uh, you got a mm, injury, and uh, part of it will pop up to, to stay and show that uh, you're in bad condition. Also, you can check some ammo with the special keys. Most probably it's twelve patron. It's like like this, it's like fourteen rounds in the magazine. Have a camping over there. Maybe we can drop some guitars later but we already dropped them on another camping camping location okay let's see what's going on he didn't what about uh, the his history of tarkov it's about his history of tarkov uh history of tarkov so they had the tarkov is a russian fictional city and it's quite european city with uh, lots of uh, you know uh European style of infrastructure and the development of the city. <coughs> it's located between the Saint Petersburg and Murmansk, and uh, uh, there are lots of uh, dark, you know, stuff it's like conspiracies and corruption are going in the city. It's like you know, it's like Gotham City, but but Russian, <laughs> but Russian version of it. And uh, right I've now got we have. Here. 
we, we have a fully concealed city with, with its suburbs and, and locations. Uh, uh, the, city, the city block blocked with UN forces and Russian military forces. And, uh, you know, it's quite a, a zone uh, with, with the borders, uh, consists of snipers and minefields that you need to... We need to get out of this zone alive. So the main idea and the main idea of uh, of naming of a game is escape from Tarkov. You need to escape from Tarkov for life. And uh, when you try to do it, you will see how many uh, mysteries and and uh, tasks you need to solve. It's not just the only. It's not just about the survival. It's more like human relations between, men, between the mercenaries and the local uh, guys like scavengers and UN forces and stuff. Kibo is looting a dead body. As you can see, uh, some uh, items popping up in the process. <clears throat> I've got a surprise for you. Take this one. Ooh. What's this? Okay. Like? <laughs> yes. uh, 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 George uh, dropped uh, EOTech XPS holographic scope and Kiba already installed it. Okay, Kiba got a key and uh, this key, this exact key is, uh, it's from um, from the entrance to the factory that, you know, you, you need to get get into this factory and one of, a, one of our entrance locations, it's a frontal, you know, fr frontal location to get into this factory. Thanks, Kiba. As I said before, we have a uh, three floor, two block, two blocks, two buildings of a uh, uh, city, citizen, citizen apartments, and every single room is fully searchable and lootable. So every single drawer you can open it you can break it and you can pick pick lock later pick lock and even if you have a key you can uh, buy this key from a trader later and uh, get into this location and open this door with the, with this key so um there is a lots of rooms and lots of places to be searched to be searched as i believe kibo just got the pb pistol and we'll try to Assemble it later. Yeah, Why later? Now, he said. <clears throat> there is, there is a not so, you know, there's a, not much room in his inventory. So he is assembling a pistol. Okay. How is going, Mister? He is. He's loading his gun and ready to go. Nice gun. <laughs> this is so better. right now, so right now, uh, our guys is going to fueling station, uh, gas station in America, a fueling station. I don't know how to tell it exactly. Place where you can load your car with some gasoline. Uh, and uh, we can also see some side, side mini locations like the bus stop. Покажи им bus stop. Пройдите вперед чуть. 
Yeah. We can loot the cars. Confirm machine of all that. It's closed. It's closed. Too bad. So... During, during the raid you, you, can, you can take many ways to complete the raid. You can uh, move freely and try to make your own um, route to take some advantage, advantage and complete, complete the raid really fast. It uh, depends on your knowledge of location and your tactical abilities like uh, weapons and uh, gear. I'm hit. George hit. Some tough scavenger. Minus. Nice one. Here is our gas station. Pump station. There is another one. Another one. Yeah, 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 yeah. On the gas station. Чего ты лазер-то не врубил? А, Киба switched off his laser pointer to make some sneaky action. Okay, <laughs> friendly. Time to loot some po some bodies. In escape from Tarkov, you can die uh, sim simply from one bullet. Uh, you, can, uh, you can get a hit. You can get hit uh, on the stomach with a single bullet and bleed, bleed out to death. Uh, there's, a, there's a lots of different yeah. ways to, you know, to die. Let's get out of here. On this uh, uh, exact location, uh, there will be some limitation of uh, PMC players. Players of this location consist of two types of players, PMCs, it's like Bear or, and Usec, and the Scavengers. Scavengers uh, is uh, it's a wave-based uh, spawns. They can you know, rush you out from the location, and uh, Usec and Bear's limitations are between 10 or 14 people. So right now we're playing just two of uh, PMC characters, but we can play in this locations like 10, uh, 10, 10 players. With uh, you, you can uh, get get in this raid with your friends and to to cooperate and try to win. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Kiba, what's going on? He's killing me, Jor. Kiba just killed Jor. George. <laughs> he thought that George is gonna... Uh, he thought that George uh, will betray him, but he takes the action first and killed him. Wait a So, the Kiba is all alone with some scavengers. And he opened the uh, entrance to the factory. Mm. 
this in this location uh, you, you have a prerequisite that tells you that uh, there is a not a good option to kill your friends to kill your PMCs or even uh, not your PMC or just every P PMC operator and you will receive some minuses in karma and if you have a low karma you will get some strange stuff like you are going to be sick for no reason you're gonna you're going to take more gems okay Kiba is dropped and I think this is our first uh, session it's probably about uh, I don't know four o'clock maybe well where am I exactly Oh, it's empty. I see someone. Here we are. Is it you? Yeah. Great. Please don't kill me. Are you friendly? <laughs> I'm friendly. Are you sure? Well, but you, you look Russian, mate. You are not so friendly. So what is this? Yeah, great. You told Let's me something. Some loot. Okay, I follow you, lead. This way. You're gonna shoot me, aren't you? You no, go no, first. No, no way. Okay. I don't trust you. You got a Russian accent. Is this it for me? Oh, great, yeah, thank yeah, you. It's, it's good to be a streamer, you know. I'll cover you. Great. Okay, what's we have here? Um, shotgun and dozen of shells, grenades, some scope, silencer. Um, I don't know. Seems good to me. Haven't had that much when I was a scavenger. So, anything interesting around? Yeah, let's go. Are you sure we're done here? And yeah, there's... totally. But it seems big, you know. Let's check some. Well, yeah, well, I'd like to check here. Yeah. Well, oh, not nice place. That seems empty to me. Oh no, I found something. It's a cricket. Well, don't need this really. This one is uh, matches. Are you kidding me? Okay, never mind. Let's keep moving. Follow me, my friend. No, you're the following. Uh, <laughs> Again, well. this way. Okay. Maybe we do some parkour? Well, if you think so. Right. Yeah, almost. <laughs> uh. Nailed it. Let me took some loot. Um. Well, you can take some. But if you'll find some, still. Caliber, please give it to me. Where is the 12th caliber? Oh, Silence. You want to okay, pick some shells? Dude, there is some shooting. Okay. okay I think. I'll cover okay. you. You can search the place.
And it's in volleyballs, yeah. Yeah. Some armor and uh, guns. Grab as much as you can and uh, and keep up. Wait for a second. Okay, I'm ready. Next. Let's get out of here. Follow me. There is that door. You can open it. Pardon me? What are uh. you trying? Oh. Ah, I know this place. We made an ambush there on the bridge. Any yeah, volleyball sure. here? I think no. Really? Anyway, I'm going to check. Now, how are you, my friend? Ah, uh, is it a sneakers? Oh. Sneakers. Sorry. Shit, shit, shit. Shutting me. I'm in the wrong place. I don't see anybody. Please repeat. I heard someone on the left. 11 o'clock. Oh my god, it's so loud. Red guy out. I'm on your six. On the left side. I saw someone, yeah, on the left. Near the car. Second one. I think it's I'm too far empty. for a champion. Oh. I've got one. It's enemy down. Not a got one. <laughs> someone on the left. He's behind. I didn't see him. Well, it might be Kibo, you know. <laughs> My previous friend. Well, well, well. What do we have I here? I think it's clear. Oh, on the bridge. Behind. Taking cover. I'll check. Oh my fucking <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> well, <laughs> I think it's okay. <laughs> Enemy down. There is uh, a rifle for you. Wait a second. I'll check uh, these dead guys. Uh, do you need uh, 
a pistol. <laughs> no, thanks. No? I'm great. Slippers. I've got, got slippers. And uh, Zibo. Ah, screw it. I want more fighting. Not scavenging. I'm not a scavenger anymore. I'm a professional military guy. It's always the shooting. Where's my rifle? George? Check the car. Near the... no. <laughs> Near the, the face of Kiba. Oh, I found it. Great. Well. Mac. Whoa. Anything in sight? Probably not. Know. Let's go third. Wait a second. Gotta take a look at the M4 rifle. I'm gonna replace this one uh, with uh, that one. Well, I don't need this one as well. Now it's way better. I'm ready to go. Any movement there? I didn't see anybody. Uh, okay, let's turn left and... Uh, let's check the bus. Bus? Why? Are you about to leave somewhere? <laughs> I'm not sure if it's working. Okay, it seems, seems like... Very old one. Как мне тут пиздец, как не нравится, но выхода у нас нет. Never mind, we still got work to do. Дикие еще эти, их только не хватало. There is some buildings. Yeah, dorm. I think they waiting for us, yeah. I'll check the this side, the right side. Um okay, I'm taking left. I see one guy. Okay. Wait, wait for me. Uh near the garbage. Another one. Oh no, come on! Refine? Yeah. A lot of trees, I can't see anything. I just heard a lot of trees. Someone in the building. Probably. They near the small building. At the front yard, near the dumpster. <laughs> he's mine, he's mine! Out of ammo. I don't have any. As well. Oh my. I'm so bad at this. He's still alive. Yeah, yeah, nice. Safe and sound. Let's check in door. Well, I need his AK. Okay. okay. <laughs> Where? Where from? I... Um, I killed them. It sounded painful. Ok, 
okay, I'm, I'm almost out of home, I'm gonna take some. I'll go for the key. I don't know, man, I'm empty. Should I keep this rifle? Or not? Probably gonna switch to my pistol. Well, I don't need this anymore. anymore. I've got oh, a key. It's almost full. What do you have? Uh, I got a key. A key? Great. Where is it? Okay, you keep it. My pockets. Um, do you think there is something interesting in this dormitory? Check it, I'll cover you. Uh, I know, man, it looked uh, abandoned a long time ago. Probably not gonna find anything special here. It's supposed to be a kitchen, probably. Yeah, Cricket again. Okay, let's go. Well, wait, wait. I found a medkit. Um. There is a lot of locked doors. I'm wasting time. Okay, okay. Got you. Someone outside. Okay, I'll check. Do you see anybody? No, it's clear. Let's go. Would you look at that? <laughs> uh, Adorable. Nothing special probably. Some cans, guitar, empty bikes. Ah, uh, no nothing. So, you said you have a factory key? Yeah, I've got one. Here's a fuel station. Let's check it and go and uh, leave the location. Actually, I'm lost. <laughs> okay, it's nothing. Oh, how are you? Here am I. Nice. Let's go. Where to? Heard someone. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, the tough guy. He's probably armored. I'll check the the body. He's got a frag. Do you need one? I actually got one. So okay, I'll you keep it. it. Yeah. Ah! Be careful. Got a situation here. Yeah. He's dead. Let's go home. Wow. Where are you? <laughs> I've got my legs broken and I'm probably bleeding. I've Give me got a sec. Some meds for you. <laughs> I've Do got you need one? I got two, thank you. Okay. I'll cover it. Well, it's done. Okay, let's check fuel station. I'm going to live. Okay. I'll cover you from the right. Okay. Affirmative. 
<laughs> Roger that. Do you copy? <laughs> copy. I hear someone. Stay quiet. Where is there? There is one. Carefully. I'm near. Don't shot me. We don't okay. want. We don't want this accident. <laughs> like, like in the sun. Ah, I'm dead. I see him. Put him back. Who am I talking to? You're dead. This looks like a end for me. <laughs> well, this is guys. Okay, uh, let's continue the last uh, the last uh, feature that we are go that we are planned to show on the stream is uh, it's a uh, mm, we are we are alone this location and we have some nice uh, uh, AK tuned uh, tuned and and uh, ready for action uh, so uh, we can show you some uh, interfaces like. Uh, uh, открывай, короче, интерфейсы. So, uh, we have a, a cheater backpack. It's a Kiba developer's profile. It's c it it has quite a lot of uh, weapon details, magazines, and stuff. Uh, we also have some two weapons. It's an AK with some with lots of mods installed. <coughs> uh, this is a weapon modification menu, and you c we can change nearly everything, as you know. It's like we can add the tactical abilities. We can change max. He's reloading right now. You can change model devices for different ones. We can change form grips, tactical grips, stocks and so on. So this is an AK and we are located on the garage section of the map. It's a uh, citizen garage garages for uh, vehicles. Uh, uh, we have a uh, tr true ballistic system and uh, every single bullet has a has a speed and a muzzle velocity also every surface can has an ability to make some ricochets and penetrations I just uh, sh shot on this door and as you can see, we have a ricochet and the bullets flew over there. These blocks can be penetrated and uh, when the bullet hit this block, it can change trajectory. So, uh, we also have exit, exit uh, holes and the bullet uh, uh, changed its its uh, trajectory and moved up there this is a so it's also uh, applies to a, a body uh, you can uh, get a bullet and it can change the trajectory uh, into your body it can hit your internal organs uh, simultaneously and exit on the back and hit some somebody else in the head so we can kill f not only 
one person with a bullet maybe more so also we have a uh, M4 it's also customized heavily it's like sniper version and uh, we don't recommend to use this weapon like this and it looks like this it, it also has a untuned uh, laser sight and the scope and also attached flashlight with laser and stuff also we have an ability to uh, load some different types of ammo it's uh, quite a big amount of ammunition and uh, we have some really bad uh, manufactured ammunition and it can jam your weapon even um, broke break it so this is once again as you can see we have some ricochets I'll switch to full auto oh it's a single okay this is it for our ballistic system We can, we, you can look on your weapon also check uh, the amount of ammo it's 29 and also check uh, round in the chamber and uh, you can do this with every weapon you have it's a TT pistol it's a classic Russian pistol it have a really powerful it has really powerful ammunition you can make a tactical reload with a mag drop here you can see the dropped uh, TT uh, magazine and uh, called AR15 magazine So, uh, oh, we have also some new grenade, it's F1, it's also Russian grenade. So here is uh, our skill system. We can talk about it. It's uh, this is our our skills. It's uh, based on a repetitive uh, uh, type of earning the skills. You can we, you need to do exact action uh, to boost up uh, your levels of the skills. Uh, we have five types of skills. It's uh, practical, combat, special, physical, and uh, mental and every single skill has its uh, positive and negative mostly positive uh, stuff like this it can increase your time of sprint and can lower your uh, recoil and so on also we have some fancy stuff like this it's all the skills that we have right now uh, we also have a feature if you're uh, if you can uh, the, le the level of uh, exact skill can be decreased uh, if you didn't play a game for a long time so this is our hurls it has a zone based uh, zone based style also some uh, physical characteristics like body temperature, radiation and biological poisoning, blood pressure, hydration and energy levels and this uh, this all uh, so uh, influence on your uh, combats on your uh, players reaction
So, uh, I think uh, we will... Uh, uh, I think this is it for now, uh, and this is our f you know, first uh, stream in that, you know, that gameplay features and stuff. So, uh, we are very... We're very glad uh, to tell that we are happy that uh, we managed to do it, and uh, it's really nice that you came by. Thank you, everybody, and uh, let's uh, meet uh, sometime, uh, sometime more. We'll we plan to make these uh, streams, make this tr the streams more often, and uh, we hope that you liked everything that we show. So uh, thank you and goodbye.